everything you scan with the snack scope winds up in the journal. I have more for you to do, but Wambus is scaring all the snacks away. You'll have to come back later. Until then, you should get Philbo out of here. <sighs> Let's get this over with, buddy. Hey, Snacksburg, we're almost in town. Hell yeah. Well, here we are. Woo wee! It's a regular old ghost town. I don't know what I expected. Without Lisbert around, nobody would want to come back here. Oh, it's not much, but it's still home. Let's get moving. Oh, is this my ship? Can I jump? I can't jump. Or run, or do anything. That's unfortunate. Can you imagine what kind of, like, horrific monsters lie by that volcano? It's gonna be terrible. I'm sorry. I guess you're not gonna get that interview with Lisbert just yet. Really? Me? I mean, if you want to. Um, <laughs> ask away, I guess. Mm. Well, Lisbert asked me to tag along, so I dropped everything and here I am. I'm Philbo Fiddlepie. I guess I'm sort of like a deputy mayor. I don't know. I'm not good at most stuff, but I like to help out. I'm not good at most stuff either. <laughs> Pretty relatable character so far. Oh, they're great. I mean, they taste good and they make everybody happy. So what's not to love? Lisbert and me go way back. Lisbert was, is awesome. She always knew what to do, and she brought out the best in all of us. She beat me in charge of watching Snacksburg when she went out hunting. I mean, I wasn't really in charge. Nobody took me seriously. But as long as Lisbert came back with bug snacks, everything was fine. One day, Lisbert went out hunting and she didn't come back. I tried to step up and keep everybody calm. Well, technically, I was in charge, right? But uh, that didn't last long. There was a big fight and then an earthquake and then everybody decided they'd be better off alone. They couldn't even keep us together for one day. I honestly don't know what Lisbert saw in me. Aw, oh, poor Philbo. He's getting more and more sad by the moment. Uh, sorry, buddy. I didn't want to bum you out. Lisbert might be gone, but you're here now. Nobody listened to me, but you? You're pretty good at stuff, and, well, nobody hates you yet. You can catch bug snacks. And bring everybody back to Snacksburg. Once they're here, you can do some more interviews and figure out what happened to Lisbert. You should find Gramble on the beach. If we get his ranch going again, that'll be a big help. You could also go back and talk to Bethlehem, I guess. Anyway, I'll be here if you need any advice. All right. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> I'm really glad they, like, show the characters' names in the- I mean, uh, faces in the subtitles, because I'm not gonna remember. Alright, gone home, complete. I guess, uh, what's-his-face here could give How me a side doing? quest. Oh, an interview, yeah. An interview? Alright, but keep it short. I got work to do. Wambus Troubleham, farmer. 
Well, that was pretty simple. Oh my god, well, this is a mistake. Oh, uh, what do I think about bus names? They're pesky, tasty, and confusing. Well, they ain't animals, and they ain't plants. No organs, no seeds, nothing. And you have to eat them raw, or they turn to mush. Now I call that confusing. Well, when Lisbert vanished, I knew we needed a reliable food source. Without snacks, I figured I'd farm sauce as an alternative. Though we would have been fine on bug snacks if it weren't for Gramble. Ah, uh, stupid Gramble. Oh, that opened up like four questions. Holy crap. Oh, I don't really want to ask that. That weepy little rancher thinks all bug snacks are his pets. Oh, so he's nice to them and you resent that? Okay. Who's Triffany? <sighs> well, when you've been married oh, this wife. long, the little spats just pile up. Doesn't take much to knock them all down. Respectable type, Elizabeth. We'd trade sauce for snacks now and again. Or plants for Dr. Batter Nugget to fix his medicine. Dr. Batter Nugget? Oh, that's the town doctor. You know, Egabel. Liz's partner. Okay, Egabel Batter Nugget. I think that's a record for, like, the dumbest name in this game so far. And I'm totally okay with that. I couldn't say. She was off hunting most of the time. Dangerous work. Could have slipped and fell. Could have got caught in an earthquake. Could have got thrown in a volcano. Um, do I have to ask all the questions or? Like I can afford that. Seems like you never had to pay property taxes. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Good, I don't have to ask more about his wife. I think I've asked enough. Seems like a waste of your time. If you want answers, you need hard evidence. Here, I dug this up the other day. I'm thinking it might help you find Elizabeth. Now, back to work. Wambus gave you notes about strange about a strange device. Check your journal for details. Alright. Uh, some of the, like, oh, I could sleep, I guess. Some of the adult references in this game are pretty fun so far, like, you never had to pay property tax. Also, this might be Elizabeth's, uh, this might be her house, given that, like, explorer expedition hat right there. Seems pretty barren, though. Wait, what time, what time is it right now? It's five in the morning, okay. Let's sleep until noon. I don't know what sleeping does, but we'll find out. Maybe there's like different bug snacks, different times of the day, and that's why there's like a sleeping mechanic. That's that's what I would guess. Ew. <laughs> does there really have to be an outhouse? We don't we can't don't have like personal toilets? I'm gonna guess this is the beach. Simmering Springs. So weird how the camera like trails off once you go into like a loading screen. Snacksburg is inhabited again. A surprising discovery. You. You are the ignoble journalist. Despite your lack of any and all useful skills, I require your assistance. Yeah, who are you? You look very nerdy, like a scientist. I'm gonna go with scientist. Tell me, tell me you're a scientist. What a meritless question. Now, my experiments were halted with the unfortunate oh, yeah. disappearance of Agabel. Since the settlement's dissolution, finding new subjects has been vexing. A bit of gastronomic biochemistry. Never mind the details. Silence yourself and listen. You've likely witnessed grumpus limbs transforming into bug snacks. I call this process snackification. 
Under normal circumstances, this occurs at random. However, I have developed a method to direct the effect to specific limbs. It's simple once you understand the internal mechanisms behind the molecular dissemination of snack particles. <sighs> this is the Snacktivator. Feed me Strabby. Poke Snacktivator in foot. Foot turns into Strabby. Understand? Oh, yes. Easily. Um... Unbelievable. Very good. I will allow you to field test the Snacktivator for the time being. I, meanwhile, have some very interesting plans for my leg. I look forward to working with you further. Okay. Um... Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> Oh, okay. This guy looks like he's gonna be fun. nice and all, but you're scaring the little ones. Oh, sorry, Gramble. Inspiration is so hard to find. I just have to sing wherever it strikes me. Well, uh, maybe it could strike you over there. Oh, but I'd hate to go alone. Won't you join me for a long walk on the beach? Like a date? Of course, darling. It would just be you, me, and your delectable strabbies. Singing the night away until we drift off to sleep. No! Uh, sorry. Every time I go to sleep around you, my snacks just up and vanish. So no to all that. But the date's still a maybe. Oh, very well. I will go and seek my inspiration alone. Ta, my dear. Oh, calm down, little ones. Wiggle means well. She just don't understand you like I do. What the heck? The, uh, uh... That is the most genius design I've seen so far. Can I catch that? There's no way this is gonna work. No way whatsoever. Yeah, there's. This is not happening. <laughs> Alright, give me that back. I'm afraid of like falling off and not being able to get it, but whatever. Hello? You? Haven't seen me around here before. If you're looking for bug snacks, you best turn back. These little ones are my kin. Well, that's a relief. Sorry to be short with you. I haven't slept much lately. I'm Gramble Giggle Funny. I'm an aspiring bug snacks breeder. I'm not too keen on going to town, but I'm running out of room down here. I want to get back to my barn. Trouble is, some of my snacks went missing. I'm not going back till they're all home. If you want to help me, then I got a friend to introduce you to. Follow me. There we go. I almost forgot about the retrieval mechanic. Strabby, Strabby, Strabby! See that, Strabby? That there's Sprout. I've been training him to follow my pointer in his buggy ball. We were in the middle of training. See if you can guide Sprout back here to us. <laughs> oh yeah, is this like... I like how we... This is like super monkey ball, I guess, but with a laser pointer. Um... Strappy! Alright, um... Oh, 
Come on, little strawby, you can make it. I don't know, down there. There you go. That is more fun than it has the right to be. I like that a lot, actually. Hey, come back here! Don't you dare go down there. He likes you! Sprout's always been a good judge of character. Sprout loves adventure. Always got along well with Lizbert, too. Anyway, I'm missing my three peel bugs. They like to hide out inside little holes around the beach. Please find them. Those little cuties must be so scared without me. Catch the last peel bugs. All right. Oh, bye, everybody. Can I just, like, catch those two for him? To, like, I don't know, help him out? Because he's afraid of them running away. Like, barely so. There's, like, an orange snake in here, I guess. Um, I want the laser pointer, but... Oh. Can I, can I catch you? Oh, dang it. Okay. Orange peel bug. Can I, like... I can probably look that up in my journal, right? Oh, that's the... Okay. Rolls up and hides inside holes or logs. They have to be pushed out somehow. Huh, alright. Take you back, put you away. Snakiri? Leaps in and out of the ocean needs to be caught mid-leap. How? Like... With my net? Or... With the trap? I don't know if I can catch this guy yet, like... Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, I'll come back later. There's gotta be something else to do. Oh, we got a pineapple, like... Guy. Pine... Pinantula. Wow. Burrows into the sand to hide. Perhaps another bug snack could dig it out. Hmm. Love the hair. Is it all natural? Oh my goodness. Alright, well. I've had a fun time so far, but that'll be it for bug snacks today. I gotta go take some medicine. Hope you guys all enjoyed, and uh, I'll see you next time to talk about bug snacks some more. Take care.